How to add a static map to your website. Welcome to this new jog tutorial. In this one, I will show you how to add a static map to your website and all the different ways you can format it. You can request the Jog Static Maps API using a GET or POST request, like shown here. In this tutorial, we will use a GET request. Let's get started. Depending on your use for the map, you might want it to display a specific route, zoom in to show a building, or simply scale it to appear bigger on your page. So let's go ahead and look at the ways to do that. For this example, let's imagine that this company who offers tours around big cities wants to show the route for their Paris by night tour. To do this, they will use the paths parameter. So first, let's copy and paste the basic GET request into our code. For the map to display, we will first need to grab our access token in the JOG lab and paste it here. Now, let's work backwards and look at the different elements of the request that we can edit to match our needs. Static map images can be rendered in either PNG or in JPEG format. Here, we will keep PNG. The layer parameter lets you define the base map style you want to use. You can decide to use one of our default jog map style or create your own in the jog lab. For this example, let's use jog terrain. Now that we've made a few edits, let's see how the map displays. It's all right, but it looks a little small, so let's edit the size. 600 by 400 pixels should look better. The center parameter controls the coordinates of the map's landing view, meaning the point that it will center on. Then we also have the zoom level. It goes from 0 to 22 and defines the level of details shown on your map. Zoom 0 is the entire planet, and Zoom 20 can be used to focus on a single building. Please know that when using the paths or region parameters, you actually don't need to specify the zoom and center parameters. The Static Maps API will determine the most suitable zoom level and center the static map to see all paths. Let's reload and see our changes. Great! Now, for the main event, the paths parameter. Let's copy our missing parameters. Path color and its weight. And of course, the last thing to do, paste our coordinates. These will be separated from the weight with the pipe's encoded value, percent %7C, and from the zoom parameter with an ampersand. And there you have it, a beautiful static map showing the Paris by night route. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to comment below the video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next Jog Maps tutorial.